Hello and wel- hello and welcome back to Stick It to the Man Part Two. We are now on Chapter Four. I forget what it's called, <laughs> but this is a really cool platformer game that is like all of the people are paper and it's like a really interesting art style and I'm actually enjoying it quite a bit so far and it has pretty good humor in it um so let's get back to it last time that we left off um our main character which I don't even remember the name of but our main character just got home from the hospital. Looks and weird. The what? On his head. Uh, the arm is sticking out of my head. Uh, I know it looks weird, uh, but there's it... no arm sticking out of your head. Ray, are you going nuts on me? Are you dropping insanity balls on the floor? No, I. Oh, I don't think so. You really can't see it, sweetie. Why don't you go see my shrink? Doctor Egglesworth helped me a lot. I'm not afraid of grapes anymore. See? Jeez. <laughs> Maybe I am crazy. I guess it wouldn't hurt to see Dr. Egglesworth. I believe his office is over here, uh, to the right. Okay. I'm guessing that's him. <laughs> Silly. Uh, ah, I gotcha. That's him! He's the one who took your sacred thingamabob! I know because he has a stupid haircut! I don't forget a haircut that dumb! <laughs> Agent 23 reporting in. We may have a positive on our target. Oh, hold on. Let me turn on subtitles again. Stop. Subtitles on. Instructions. Mm. Get him. Ew. Oh God. Wait, is this real? Okay. Am I being chased Can by these jerks? Or am I really just going totally nuts right now? I know, it's just so sad. And it was so sudden too. I mean, he was 140 years oh, old. Okay. Well, we all kind of assumed he would. Wait, you know? Oh, Dr. Ecclesworth, if only you hadn't taken the death of your father <laughs> your father so hard and fallen into deep depression. I'm glad you're seeing Dr. Brom. I'm also glad I'm paid by the hour. Take as long as you need, Dr. Ecclesworth. <laughs> okay. Moving on. Um, Oh, oh, fuck. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. I'm no, no, no. God dang it. Okay. So, I guess what we need to do. Oh, jeez, it's not that. Okay. See, I think that's really, really cool. That is awesome. This is really interesting, honestly. I like it quite a bit. Oh god. How much did I jump? Ah! Oh my mother! Oh god, are you serious? God dang it. So these Mr. Copies, um, every time that you die, obviously you, that's your, that's your checkpoint. Um, now go fuck yourself, oh. And I think it's really cool because when they turn, and like, I can walk all the way over here. And I can also, every time, oh, oh, seriously. Okay, I gotta, I gotta pay attention. I'm not very good at platformer games. I just think this is really interesting and it's pretty fun to play. <sighs> Jesus. Okay, now I'm gonna wait for him to get all the way over here. Oh my 
gosh. Yeah, come get me. Okay. Okay, now... Oh my god! Oh my god. Okay. Okay. Let's not suck this time. Because I'm not sucking. I, I need him over here. I cannot. Oh, sh shit. Oh no. Go back in. He makes like a dead noise. Oh, that was kind of funny. Oh, oh. oh so getting sick of this. Okay. Let's, let's go. Yeah! I swear to God, by the time I'm done with this platform. Ugh. on that way for some reason. You get it? So... Later, possibly oh imaginary god. suckers! Oh my god. That took way too long. I like his arm though. I wish it's stretched further up. It looks like it's dancing though. Wait, let's see what happens. <laughs> Dag nabbit! I'm dead now! Hey, that's an inconvenience for me, but it's not going to shut down my practice. There's still tons of people out there who need lobotomies. Stay away from me with your lobotomies, man! Also, you're not as scary as I was expecting. I'm not scary. I'm a lobotomist. And it's the only way to cure what ails you, Sonny. A few cuts, a few slips, and you won't have a care in the world. So... You... Want me... Me... To get... My brain... Removed. Okay. Oh, mother... Fucker. Oh, that's what I'm not supposed to do. Oh, make a run for it. Nope, 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 nope. Guys are snappily dressed. They're probably pretty smart. Maybe. <laughs> Whoa! I should have not stayed up all night last night eating burritos. And yet I have no regrets about staying up all night eating burritos. Ah. If I put this sticker on an agent, <laughs> sweet. This sticker makes him sleepy. Oh, I probably don't have too long until they wake up. Oh, oh. Whoa, this is heavy. I've got to get to that psychiatrist stat. Amazing, madam. 
Yes, I have made contact with the spirit of your dear departed wife. I haven't departed anywhere. I can't move in the afterlife because my husband cut off my legs. Yada! Is oh she here? God. Can you ask her if she's mad that I cut off her legs? She's saying that she is, um, slightly frustrated by the circumstances. If I could touch him, I'd tear his legs off too! Yeah, definitely sensing some frustration. <laughs> Okay, that's uh, I wonder what that thing is. After I apologize for cutting off her legs, I should ask her if she knows where I put my rabbit. I haven't seen him for weeks. The rabbit don't just disappear. Oh, wait, no. I made him disappear and then couldn't get him back. Okay, yeah, note to self. Stop by pet store on the way home. I can't walk into the light or anywhere else for that matter. Either someone needs to find me some legs, or someone needs to kill a wheelchair and send its ghost over my way. How amazing it is that ghosts really do exist. And how incredible that they all want to talk with my paying customers. At least this ghost knows a language. I'm so tired of being bothered by caveman ghosts from thousands of years ago. That's fair. Okay then. Uh, we're gonna go to the psychiatrist. Uh, excuse me, uh, doctor? Um, doctors? Dr. Brahma, I can't go back to work. I just can't. Dad hated how I practiced my profession, and now that he's gone, we'll never reconcile. There's no closure left for me. I'll never be able to talk to him again. Mm-hmm. And how does that make you feel? Sad, I guess. Mm-hmm. And how does that make you feel? The sadness? No, oh, um, like, not happy? Like I have emotions that are making me depressed. Mm-hmm. And how does that make you feel? Wait, how does that make you feel? <laughs> Fine, thank you, but we're here to discuss you. Dang, I gotta help Dr. If only I could talk to my dad one more time. Get him to understand why I do what I do. I just need one last chat with him. Man, I don't need a psychiatrist. I need a medium, or at least a necromancer. Wait. Necromancers don't really exist, do they? No, I, I think they're all frauds. Okay, medium it is. <laughs> so wow, did work get a lot easier when I realized I could ask. And how does that make you feel? To every question. Oh, how many stickers? Okay. Um, balloons for sale! Balloons for sale! I've taken some finite helium supply and put it inside a leaky disposable balloon. You should buy it! Okay. <laughs> Alright, round 37. Whoever has the shortest legs gets punched. Again! Ready, Gigator? Ready, Colossus? Ready, Little Jump? What? No! No! One, two, three, go! Wait, no, wait, no! Oh! Oh! oh my gosh, are they? Hey, Jace! Jace! They're about to pull off the rally scene, trampoline, trivets, maneuver! Ladies and gentlemen, this trick is very difficult to pull off. Let's watch. A complete success and a very painful landing for little champ. Ha! Poetry in motion. Well, it was worth a shot. Uh, okay. Anything else at all? Okay. Other commission. Aha! I can see that. Okay. Oh shit. <laughs> Oh, what did I do? Huh? 
Okay, let's go. We'll go to that one first. And that one. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is so funny. Oh wow. Shoot. I didn't do that right. Okay, let's try that again. I know what I need to do now though. Okay. Now they both see me. of heights they're not heights once you hit the bottom <sighs> jump dang it dad i don't want to fall to my death please stop hitting my hands next time i'm not bringing the inflatable hammer okay i know what to do okay. oh helium gas dump Jump right now! Come on, we're not that high up! What? What's happening? Help me, son! Dad, uh, I can't. If I uh, let go, I'll die! Help me, please! Dad, I'll die! Oh, great! Now I'm gonna die, and my dad is a balloon! That second fortune cookie I got was also right! I need to stop eating at Crazy Jack's crazy but insanely accurate fortune cookie restaurant! <laughs> Oh, great, now... <laughs> I want to kiss my cousin. Okay, you need something. Okay, oh, uh, go down here. Oh, uh, I still don't have a sticker for you, I'm sorry. Okay, we're just gonna back up. Back up. Uh, where do I go? Where do I go? Oh, hi. Uh, now, who do I get? Oh, that was awesome! I think. Okay. That was it. I confess I cannot see the attraction to being fired out of a cannon, but I do see the attraction of being responsible for the safety of those who do choose this path. Okay. I confess I cannot. <laughs> That's gonna come out of my bed sack, I think. I do. Okay, I see this. Oh, there we go. Thank you.
the, uh, what are we aiming at? How come we're not hitting the usual wall? Right on target, right? <sighs> this isn't part of the end! Dad, I've got you! Whoa! This is an amazing trick! You invented this yourself? I kinda... You know, it's not so scary when we're both hanging here together. This is the best trick ever! This is perfect! You're perfect! We'll never do that old trampoline trick again. This blows it out of the water. I'm so happy. I love you, son. Oh. Oh, yes. yeah. I hope you don't fix the doctor's problem with a smile. Worth a shot. Maybe we have to go all the way back. Oh. No. Wow. So we have to figure out a way to get... Excuse me. Oh, yes, hello. Well, take a good look. Here I am, the bearded <laughs> lady. Isn't that crazy? Doesn't that mess with your ideas of gender and beauty? I... I guess? Well, soak it up, because there's no refunds. Okay. Oh. 
What am I gonna think about her? Easiest job in the world. It's amazing what a little super glue, a shave dog, and a lot of patience can do. Okay. Oh. No. Well, is that anything I can stick to? That won't stick. No. That won't stick. The trampoline triplets maneuver! Put your backs into it, boys! Not a problem! Get ready to have your minds body slammed! Not again! Wait a second! Your legs are tinier than mine! You've been faking this for years, Gigator! Library school, here I come! Oh, our wrestling slash bullying careers! Say, kid, there's an opening in that. Yeah, you ever give any thought to being. Do you know, if I could get on the radio, there'd be no way for the audience to know that the triplets aren't here anymore. Folks, the triplets just threw a bad guy wrestler into the moon and then punched him on the nose when he landed. I can't believe my eyes. You should, though. supply and put it in oh perfect legs out of nowhere this will definitely be all I need in my eternal afterlife goodbye sweetie I loved you more than I love even magic itself which is too bad because if I studied magic harder you wouldn't have died okay I'm glad that's done so, handsome, how long do you think it'll be before you get back into dating? Oh, I don't know, a few... Minutes? Well, that'd be quite the trick. Squeaky <laughs> disposable Good, her mind I like shapes and colors. Especially when those shapes are inflated. Sometimes I wonder if this is really what I was put on this earth to do. Sometimes I get sad. Planet's finite helium supply. Oh, <laughs> you poor lady. Uh, I mean... yeah. And how does 
that made you feel? I've pulled back the veil between our world and the next one! What? Huh? Are there any spirits with which you would like to speak? Dad, I want to talk to my dad. He looks a little like me, only he's super old. Ghost of the skies, old dad, I command you here. What? Who called me? Dad, it's me. I... I just wanted to talk to you. To make peace about how you love lobotomies, and I love treating people without cutting into their skulls. Son, I... I... I have a mind to lobotomize you right here! You've been losing this argument for years, and now even when I'm dead, you drag me back so you can get one last word in? Of all the selfish, self-interested, totally deserving of a lobotomy <laughs> actions to do! And another thing, son. I... I love you. Even though we have different approaches, we're both on the same team. We just okay. don't want to see people be sad. <laughs> You're doing good, so son. And I'm proud of you. You know that, right? I do now, Dad. That's my cue. You be good, boy. Hooray! At last! An emotional breakthrough! Closure! Huh? What? What happened? What I miss? I talked to my dad! He's a ghost, and we talked, and we worked things out! I can go back to work now, thank you! <laughs> what? Ghosts? Oh, that's crazy talk! You're crazy! What? No, I'm not crazy! He was a vision from beyond the grave! I'm not crazy! Uh, okay. Next! I... I guess that's me! Excellent, excellent! Uh, sit down here. And tell me all about <laughs> how whatever your issue is makes you feel. Oh, well, I've, I've got this giant spaghetti arm that comes out of my head. And only I can see it. Oh, but it, but it lets me read people's minds. Telepathy, huh? <laughs> that definitely sounds crazy. Ooh, but before I give you my diagnosis, uh, there's one thing I'd like to try. Follow the pendulum. You are getting sleepy. You are about to tell me all your secrets. So... dang... sleepy... What are you doing here? So that ends this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. Like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next episode.